Jerry Brownlee and Nikki Kay are the winners in a cabinet reshuffle announced by the Prime Minister Bill English today. Nikki Kay has been appointed Education Minister. Jerry Brownlee will take over foreign affairs following the, following the retirement of Hekia Parata and Murray McCulley, who will leave Parliament at this year's election. Here's what Mr English had to say this afternoon. As you know, Hekia Parata and Murray McCulley will be attending their final cabinet meeting next week. Uh, so today I'm announcing their replacements as Ministers of Education and Foreign Affairs, as well as some other changes. Uh, Ms Parata will be succeeded as Education Minister by Nikki Kay, uh, who is well placed to assume responsibility for education, having done an extended apprenticeship as the Associate Minister of Education and having particular interest, energy and motivation. Uh, Mr McCulley will be replaced by Jerry Brownlee, uh, who is relinquishing his roles as Minister Supporting uh, Christchurch, Minister of Defence, Minister of Civil Defence and Leader of the House, uh, so that he can take on the time-consuming responsibility for advocating on New Zealand's behalf internationally, particularly at a time of significant global instability. I want to pay tribute to the outstanding contribution Ms Parata and Mr McCulley have made in their ministerial roles. Uh, Ms Parata's relentless focus on student achievement has changed the conversation about learning in all our schools and driven sharp rises in achievement, particularly for our Māori and Pacifica students. Mr McCulley has improved existing relationships and developed new relationships between New Zealand and other countries uh, while running a truly independent uh, foreign policy for New Zealand. Uh, this is not an easy feat but one he has accomplished uh, in an increasingly complex world. I also want to pay tribute to Mr Brownlee for his unceasing efforts to put Christchurch back on its feet after the 2011 earthquake, earthquakes uh, and the enormous personal commitment uh, that he's made to that work uh, now over seven years.